Will Kanye West's new shapewear line be a success? Kim Kardashian's ex-husband Kanye West is launching a shapewear line that could be a major competitor to her own brand's Kim's. And this news has left everyone in awe. The internet has been on fire since the news got out. Kanye West is no stranger to the fashion industry. He has his own clothing line Yeezy and has collaborated with brands like Adidas and Gap. He is also known for his innovative designs and his ability to market his products. West has already hired employees and has a business model in place for his new shapewear line. He is reportedly calling it Body Armor, and it will focus on comfort and support. The line is expected to launch in early 2024. Kardashian is reportedly frightened by the competition from West, but she is also determined to stay ahead of the curve. Skims has been a huge success, thanks to its wide range of sizes, inclusive models, and innovative designs. The upcoming battle between Skims and Kanye West's new shapewear line is sure to be one of the most anticipated fashion rivalries of the year, and it will be interesting to see who comes out on top. More about it in this video. Before moving on, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon to enjoy the latest uploads from our channel. Let's get the video started. Kim Kardashian has been making headlines lately for her fashion choices. She has been spotted wearing thrift store finds and old clothes from her closet, and she's even been accused of being a fashion imposter. But what if Kim is actually onto something? What if she's deliberately choosing to wear affordable, off-the-rack clothing in order to challenge the traditional definition of luxury? After all, Marc Jacobs, one of the most respected designers in the world, recently tapped Kim to be the face of his new campaign. And while Jacobs is known for its high-end designs, he's also not afraid to experience with more casual styles. So maybe Kim is the one who is redefining fashion. Maybe she is showing us that it's possible to look stylish and put together without spending a lot of money. Of course, not everyone is on board with Kim's new fashion philosophy. Some people think she's setting a bad example for her fans, while others believe she's just trying to stay relevant. But one thing is for sure, Kim Kardashian is definitely making a statement. And whether you love it or hate it, you can't deny that she's getting people talking. Kanye West is reportedly gearing up for a major fashion takeover, and it looks like he's coming for Kim Kardashian's Skims brand. According to a now-deleted post from Dr. Noah, Kanye is in talks with Canadian entrepreneur and apparel manufacturer Dove Charney, the founder of American Apparel. Charney is known for his edgy, provocative designs, which were once hugely popular in the early 2000s. If Kanye and Charney are able to work together, it could be a major coup for the rapper. American Apparel was once one of the most successful apparel brands in the country, and its designs were often copied by other brands. Kanye could use Charney's expertise to create a new fashion empire that rivals Skims. Of course, nothing is official yet, but it's clear that Kanye is up to something. He's been teasing new fashion projects on social media, and he's been spotting meeting with fashion industry insiders. It's too early to say what Kanye's new fashion line will look like, but we can tell it's sure to be controversial. Kanye is known for his bold and daring designs, and he's not afraid to push the boundaries. Kanye West is reportedly gearing up to launch a new fashion line under his own banner, Yeezy Industries. This move comes after West reportedly grew frustrated with his lack of control over Skims, the shapewear company he co-founded with his ex-wife, Kim Kardashian. According to a source, West is taking full control of what is rightfully his and is democratizing fashion with his new line. The source also said that West is embracing a bold venture to build his own realm and is committed to making his products affordable. West's decision to launch his own fashion line is a significant departure from his previous business model. In the past, West has partnered with major brands like Adidas and Gap to create his Yeezy line. However, these partnerships have reportedly limited West's creative control. With his own fashion line, West will have complete control over the design, marketing, and distribution of his products. This will allow him to create the kind of fashion he wants, without having to compromise with anyone else. It remains to be seen how West's new fashion line will be received by consumers. However, there is no doubt that it will be a major event in the fashion world. Kanye West and Bianca Sensori are a force to be reckoned with in the fashion industry. West is a renowned designer and entrepreneur, while Sensori is a talented architect and businesswoman. Together, they're creating a new clothing brand that is sure to make waves. While Wes is known for his innovative designs and his ability to create trends, Sensori is a gifted businesswoman with a keen eye for detail. Together, they're a perfect match. 
Bianca holds a degree in architecture and was associated with Kanye's design company Yeezy prior to their relationship. She became the head of architecture of the company in 2020, according to Marie Claire. She is serving as West's muse and is helping to shape the creative direction of the new brand. She is also managing West's daily schedule and overseeing his business deals. With her help, West is able to focus on his creative work while she ensures that the brand is set up for success. Another reason for Bianca holding such a huge amount of responsibility is to ensure that Kanye spends all of his energy in preparation of his presidential campaign that will be held in 2024. The new brand is generating a lot of buzz ahead of its launch. Fans are eager to see what West and Sunsori come up with. With their combined talents, fans are anticipating it to be something so special that wins everyone's hearts the moment it is launched. Kanye West is not letting his troubles with Adidas stop him from moving forward with his fashion brand. The rapper has reportedly opened a new Yeezy office in Los Angeles, situated right next door to a building owned by the German sportswear giant. The new office is located on Melrose Avenue between Laurel and North Edinburgh Streets. Interestingly, the only thing that separates the two buildings is a hairdresser. This is a symbolic gesture, as it shows that West is not afraid to stand up to Adidas and continue to pursue his own vision for the Yeezy brand. Adidas terminated its partnership with West in October 2022 due to the rapper's string of anti-Semitic comments. However, West seems undeterred and is determined to make the Yeezy brand a success on his own term. The new office is set to be focused on the design and launch of new clothing lines. It is also rumored that Wes is planning to expand the Yeezy brand into other areas, such as footwear, accessories, and much more. However, his decision to open a new office next door to the sportswear giant is a clear sign that he is not going to give up without a fight and stand firm till he achieves what he is working hard for. Kim Kardashian is quaking in her boots ever since the news of Kanye West and Bianca Sensori launching their new shapewear line is out. The new line Body Armor is sure to give Skims a run for its money. And it's only a matter of time before Kanye takes the top spot in the shapewear industry. The upcoming battle between Skims and Kanye West's new shapewear line is sure to be one of the most anticipated fashion rivalries of the year. It will be interesting to see who comes out on top. Kanye West is a fashion icon, and his new line is sure to be a hit. With his creative vision and Bianca's business acumen, body armor is poised to be a major success. Kim Kardashian may have started the shapewear revolution, but Kanye West is about to finish it. What are your thoughts on it? Let us know in the comment section below. For more such videos, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. We'll see you in the next video.